Hey, what's up everyone? Today, day 15 of the winner project went live on a division 2, which means all 15 projects have now been released and you can get a hold of everything there is to offer in this season's holiday event. I have released most of these in shorts along the way, but now it's complete. I thought I'd just put it all into one video. A lot of the comments that I get and questions that I get is, am I too late? Have I missed these? Well, no, you'll see here that the winner uh, project is complete and we've still got three weeks and 22 hours to get these done they kind of like stack on top of each other so if you haven't played a division 2 for a few months and you switch on the game today or any time up till the end of that three week 22 hour period you'll start off from project day one and you'll be able to work through all of them back to back to get all 15 done so you won't miss a thing and this video is more for those that have missed this and just want to catch up very very quickly i'm now going to go through all 15 projects and exactly how to complete them while showing you what you'll be rewarded with first up is winner project day one the reward for this is this santa hat and this was a very easy one to do you simply just head to your winter project and donate 20 food once you donate the 20 food you'll get this hat for your winter project day two, your reward is this jingle bell emote. It's a little bit trickier to get this time and there's a riddle to solve. You will have to excuse some of the quality throughout this video. I'm taking it from Twitter and it ain't the best quality. It's zoomed and stuff, so I do apologize. But this clue that it gives you for day two is Adam Shipley says some supplies have been misplaced during a supply run through the holiday market south of the White House. Secure them. Hope you don't have to run around in circles. You'll need to head to this location here, just south of the White House. There's a Christmas market here. And what you're looking for at this Christmas market is the merry-go-round. So heading south from the White House, just head to the right a bit in this Christmas market. You will find the merry-go-round in front of you. And just next to this is a present that you can interact with. You want to interact with that and it'll give you a supply stash. With that supply stash, just go and donate it back at the project. And you'll have the jingle bell emote. Your reward for day three of the winter project is this holiday wrapping weapon skin. And you are given another clue to get a hold of this. The clue is we've received the report about a hidden stash at the intersection of 13th Street Northwest and G Street Northwest. Secure it. Those coordinates take you just outside of the final Epiphany safe house. So if you just fast travel here and you'll notice 13th Street Northwest is there. If we just move the map a little bit, G Street Northwest is there. And you need to head to this crossroad here. Once there, you're looking for this building, the District of Columbia. Just head straight for the main entrance. You'll be able to interact and there's your supply stash. And again, just head back to your project screen to donate this supply stash and you'll get your reward. For day four of the winter project, you are rewarded with this snowflake backpack trophy. This is another easy one. All you've got to do from the project menu is donate 20 food and you'll be rewarded with it instantly. For day five of the winter project, you're going to be rewarded with the Krampus backpack trophy. But again, there's a clue that you're going to need to solve to get a hold of it. The clue is that we've received a report about hostiles hiding a cache somewhere outside the Manning National Museum of Art. It would be great if you could secure it. To get to the location, just fast travel to District Union Arena and go south through this building. You might recognize this building because there's a hunter here. But south of the building is a Christmas market. So there's a building in front of us. Just spin around and you'll be able to interact with this present here, giving you the supply stash. Head back to the projects and donate that supply stash and you'll have your reward. For day six of the winter project, you're able to get the Santa jacket. And there's another clue that you need to solve to get it. And this time it's a little bit more trickier. We've received the report of a convoy doing supply runs between Jefferson Trade Center and Navy Plaza overnight. We need you to intercept and neutralize the convoy. They won't fall for an ambush. Nighttime on the Division 2 is from 9 p.m. onwards. And I think it goes up to 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. I'm not too sure. But for your best chance of getting this, as soon as the clock strikes 9 p.m. in-game, you'll want to go to the location for this project. 
Just go to your in-game menu like on screen now to see what the in-game time is. I'm currently at 17.19, so 20 past 5 on screen now. You just need this to be past 2100, so 9 o'clock, for it to count as night time. The location that you need to go to is on screen now. You can see this propaganda broadcast on the road. This is where you need to be. And you can fast travel to the 1040 safe house just east of Jefferson Trade Center. When you get there, if there is an event, just deal with it and you're just looking for a named enemy called the hatter in this location if you go here after 9 p.m he should just spawn even if there is an event on even if there's not an event on he should be here if not you may need to try again people have been complaining he's not been spawning but once you've got a supply stash just donate it and you'll get this item Day 7 of the Winter Project is going to give you the Candy Cane Backpack Trophy as a reward. And this is nice and easy. Again, it's just a simple donation of 20 water in the project menu to get a hold of this. For Day 8 of the Winter Project, you can get a hold of the Santa Boots. And you will have another clue to solve. It reads, we've received a report about a stash hidden in the Botanical Garden south of the capital. We need you to secure it. So to find this, just fast travel to Capitol Building and head south. And this is the building here that you need to find the stash in. Just head through the door here, take a right, and then just run straight ahead. And you'll find where you can interact to get the supply stash. Again, just donate this via the project menu and you'll have your award. The stocking backpack trophy is your award for day 9 of the winter project and this is another easy one where all you have to do is donate 20 water in the project menu. And for day 10 of the winter project you can get a hold of my favourite item in the event, the ugly green sweater. We have another clue for this and again it needs to be done at night time so following the same night time rules as before we've received the report of a convoy doing supply runs between the arc contaminated zone and the dark zone east main entrance overnight please intercept and neutralize them make sure they are already on the move before you get there so after 9 p.m in game you'll want to head to this location on screen now it's just south of the mission viewpoint museum so you can fast travel to this mission and just make your way to the position that i am at and once here what you're looking for is this truck nerdish truck is this gate and the enemy is gonna spawn inside here his name is private cole he'll be here every time but again people are struggling with this, you might need to try again if he doesn't spawn. But once you get him, you'll get the supply stash. Just donate it in the project menu. And you'll have access to the ugly green sweater. On day 11 of the winter project, you can get a hold of this Christmas carol emote. And it's very easy to do because all you've got to do is donate 20 components. Just do that in the project menu and you'll get a hold of the emote. Moving swiftly on to day 12 of the winter event and you can get a hold of this ornament backpack trophy. And there's another clue that you need to solve to get this. It reads, we've received a report about a hidden stash somewhere inside a building south of the Liberties Call safe house. I want you to go and check it out. For this one, just fast travel to Space Administration HQ and is very close by. As soon as you spawn in, you just want to take a left down the street here. And as you're going down, keep an eye on the building on the left for a doorway, which you can go through. You can see it on screen now. Head through and then go straight ahead past the desk, and there'll be a present that you can interact with to get the secret stash. Again, just donate that in the project menu and you'll have your award. Day 13 of the Winter Project is another easy one that just requires you to donate 20 components and by doing so you'll be rewarded with the Santa Pants. From the start of this Winter Project event we all knew that a new named backpack was coming called the Festive Delivery. Obviously it was a part of this project and I assumed it would be the final part. So day 15, but it actually dropped on day 14. So for day 14 of the Winter Project you're going to get the Festive Delivery Backpack. It's a Groupo piece. And it comes with a talent fireworks show where concussion grenades become festive grenades. Hitting an enemy with a festive grenade will cause explosions to happen around two other enemies within 20 meters. And obviously you can't hide the look of it. It's a Santa backpack. This actually unlocks as an appearance skin as well. So you can put this on any backpack you want as a transmod. 
To get a hold of this, you do need to solve this clue. We've tracked down the person overseeing the recent hidden stash operations that one of the control points in the western part of the city. We've heard their operation already. If you finish the job, we can party like it's the end of the world. The last part of that clue really gave it away. Just head west of the White House to the world's end control point. Once you clear it, head to the supply room and interact on the desk to find the supply stash. Then just donate the supply stash in the project menu and you'll have your festive delivery backpack. And just in case you want to see how it looks, there's a grenade going out and just look at the fireworks go as it explodes. It does look stunning. Day 15 is the final day of the project and your reward for this will be the Santa beard. And you'll have one final clue to solve to get a hold of it. It says, good job dealing with those supplies. We've prepared a reward at the holiday market south of the White House. Tommy's guarding your present. So just like with one of the earlier clues, you want to head to this location south of the White House to go to the holiday market and you're looking for this big Christmas tree. Once you find it, you'll find Tommy the Bear sitting on his throne and you can interact with the present next to him to get the supply stash. Just donate the supply stash and you'll have your reward. And there you have it, all 15 projects in one video for you. As I said at the start of the video, you can go and make a start on these now, even if you haven't started them. You've got until the 9th of January to get them all done. When the event is over, you'll not be able to get a hold of any of these items. Unless they do it again next year, which they normally do, so you can get it in a year's time if you miss it. One thing I would say is I felt like the festive delivery backpack should have been the final reward. Feels like they got that the wrong way around with the Santa beard, but. I don't know. Let me know what you think about these rewards. Did you enjoy the style of project as well? Because beforehand we only had the loot goblin. Now we've got the loot goblin and we've got these projects to do. I kind of liked it. I like the way they did it. I hope they do more stuff like this in the future as well. Kudos to Massive. It gives us something to do for 15 days. And I did enjoy it. But that's it for me now. Thank you for watching the video. I hope it's been helpful. Smash like, hit subscribe. And until next time, take care and peace out.